Here's our stock in focus. We're looking at Goldman Sachs, and Goldman Sachs is starting to top out a little bit after a very nice run, which makes sense here. But you got to, it's very important to kind of understand where you are in the longer term picture. We've talked about this a great deal, but it really has a large degree to give you an understanding where you should see, what you should expect of a move. Because um, if you have unrealistic expectations, you're bound to be disappointed. So here you have your, your prior top here, and that's always your potential target, uh, depending upon momentum here. and But you always have to also look at the longer term point. We've always brought this out, but when you look at that, it really gives you a better insight of what's starting to take place here. Um, you see a very long decline here. You see another attempt at a high here. You see it can't rally higher, breaks. Then you see it trying to make its recovery. But what you can re clearly see is I took the liberty of drawing a retracement tool here, and then you see what you do see is a 50% retracement off of that move here. So what this is clearly uh, still needing a corrective action. Well, it goes back to the corrective action here, holds, and then starts to try to recover here and does a pretty good job here, especially off the short term. But when you look at it in the bigger picture, yes, we so far have held this prior low. And look at it, is it really kind of holding this trend line? So technically, it's trying to recover.